Copa's website speaks on the 12 most obvious reasons why Craig Wright is not Satoshi Nakamoto. Now, you may recall that Craig Wright is the false pretender, the legal and patent troll who tried to usurp Bitcoin as his own, claiming to be Satoshi Nakamoto. COPA is the nonprofit organization created to defeat Craig Wright and anyone else like him. COPA's big three members are Block, led by Jack Dorsey, MicroStrategy, led by Michael Saylor, and of course, Coinbase, led by Brian Armstrong. All right, so let's read this directly from COPA's website. The title is a document, and I'll, I'll share the link um, in the description below so you can go like look at it for yourself. But the title of the document is 12 Reasons Why Craig Wright Is Not Satoshi Nakamoto, and is dated March 13th, 2024. And basically, they extracted these 12 reasons um, out of evidence that was brought forth uh, and irrefuted, um, or I should say irrefutable, irrefutable evidence that was brought forth in the trial. Reason number 10, the Genesis block. The real Satoshi would not make the serious and obvious mistake of claiming that there isn't a public key associated with the Coinbase transaction for the Genesis block. Yet that is the mistake Dr. Wright made in his statements. All right. Again, no comment. Have no idea how he's pretended to be Satoshi without this basic information. Reason number 11, the Satoshi cryptocurrency post. The real Satoshi would know that Satoshi and not Matty, I'm sorry, not Marty Malmi wrote the cryptocurrency post in July 2010. The real Satoshi would certainly not have gone on insisting the opposite in the face of clear evidence to the contrary, as Dr. Wright did. And finally, reason number 12, the transfer to GitHub. The real Satoshi would have known that in 2010 to 2011, Satoshi took no objection to Gavin and Dressen using GitHub in place of SourceForge in connection with the Bitcoin system. Satoshi would also have known that Vladimir Vanderlaan had nothing to do with the transfer and that there wasn't a shred of evidence to suggest that he had. Dr. Wright's false accounts on those points mark him as not being Satoshi. So basically, there's just a gang of evidence disproving the notion that I shouldn't even say disproving the notion, but basically undercutting, undercutting the notion that Craig Wright is Satoshi Nakamoto. Um, it's just a patently false claim, and it was laid bare in a court of law in the UK. So, yay, Copa, or good job, Copa. There was much more evidence presented to prove that Craig Wright is not Satoshi Nakamoto. Anyway, I can't believe that he made it this far uh, in these claims that he's Satoshi. Let me know what you think in the comments. So there you have it. More evidence that Craig Wright is not Satoshi Nakamoto. But like I said in my other video, I told you this years ago. Anyway, until next time, fam, holla.